Hi guys, Alex here, and today we're going to be reacting to Chantal's latest live stream, which is actually called Torrid, and I am super excited. Nothing can mend a broken heart like some good old-fashioned retail therapy, and honestly, I just wanted to throw it back to some Torrid hauls. So we're going to go ahead and take a look at her latest one. I feel like Amberlynn will always be like the Torrid queen, but Chantal has definitely stepped on her territory lately. I mean, all the conversation in this community is about foodie beauty these days and her recent antics. Let's just get right into it, shall we? Saucy, saucy. Okay, so I'm wearing one, a new bra from Torrid. I can't really show you that, I guess. But I'm wearing a jumper and it's in a size 3X. So okay. I don't know what it's going to look like. Foodie Beauty has been slimming down recently. I noticed that, but uh, I can't help but wonder if that's a side effect of the things that she has been doing. It's a very dangerous way to lose weight. I mean, I could talk about a previous experience that I had when I stopped using several years ago. It was actually the first time that I got clean. I put on about 50 pounds like that. And for someone that was my size, I think I was down to like 120 pounds. That's very noticeable. Very not good. It's not good for your body. But 3X is a bit snug, I think. Um, I shouldn't have eaten pig out these past few days. Okay, so she has been eating. Um, I definitely think that that's because she is rebounding and she's gotten her hunger back. It's going to come back big out. time. Big My time. potato patty. That is why, like, for someone with her type of brain, she has an addict brain. We know that because of the way that she eats fast food. Um, so for her to dabble in those kinds of uh, substances is very dangerous for her. It only takes one time. You guys want to see it? I'll show you what I got from Torrid and then I'll show you my... My yes. <laughs> That's what we came for. Gotta make lunch. Yeah, no problem. Alright, so first things first. Mm hmm. Uh, uh, uh. <clears throat> I want you to see my. So I did get this. It's a romper. So I might have to talk slow. Oh my gosh. So you can tell that she's like so out of breath, like just from lifting that box across the bed. So I wonder if she had to make Pete's like get this for her. I would assume that that's why she doesn't go ahead and get her own food from the door. It's just too much of a trip for her having to go down the stairs like that. That would be such a motivator for me because imagine losing your um, independence like that not being able to get your own food, not being able to get your own packages from the store. I just, I have to wonder if she needs Pete's to go to the grocery store now. If she's able to, you know, there might be something on the bottom shelf that she needs and she wouldn't even be able to get it. It's a romper. I'll show you. 3X. Again, this is... It's scary. I think everything is, but I'm not sure. Pressure's on to fit and everything. Okay, so she's... <laughs> 3x having a cheetah it's moment betsy johnson yeah oh well that fit that should fit are those carrots yeah radishes Isn't it nice i just love it i don't know i don't know about the radishes it's my first like betsy johnson thing but i love this like leopard print lately or whatever that is she must it's be like feeling a, like saucy a... i mean she has been known to wear a leopard print uh quite often actually skater dress i don't know but i'll try them on tater eventually you'll see them <clears throat> Oh, I was feeling okay. Well, what's wrong now? Got some shoes. I did see a live stream where she was laid up in the bed. You know, she had regressed to her previous behavior of laying up in the bed, which I guess is better than what she has been doing. But she was talking very strangely. She was talking about how she missed this man, the cola man. She missed him. And it was very frustrating to see what does she even see in him. She said that they had a long chat. Um, he really bared all to her. And she did as well. <laughs> well, these go with the dress. Itsy bitsy. Or some jeans. Okay. They have some nice jeans, actually. So Torres really, have... like, they have everything, They huh? look like they'd be comfortable even though they're higher up. Whoever I missed, hi! Like, they wouldn't be good with this outfit, maybe? I guess. You don't want to, like, um, you don't want to have two different cheetah prints. That's a little tacky, huh? Cute shoes. I'm the type okay. of person who just wears black shoes with everything because you don't really have to worry about it. 
What's in here now? I have like 10 pairs of black sneakers and that's all I wear. So, and one pair of good black shoes. Two pairs capri leggings, just like the black leggings, because I like to wear those in the summer. Okay. Uh, those will be nice to go for a little walk. You can have your leggings. Okay, crinkly yes. ASMR. Love that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> This is a 3X. Oh, okay. So, so I wow. guess she is uh, looks... still on the prowl. That's what I'm getting from this uh, haul here. It's really small. It comes with thong panties, which are probably in another in another box. But it's like see-through, so you can see her. Oh my goodness. Look how see-through that is. <laughs> which is nice, right? Because... Buy it for yourself. Buy it for yourself. Don't buy it for a man. Especially not a non-existent one. I know. <laughs> I know I'm a loser. loser. Alright. So I'm wearing this bra that I got. But I can just show you the pattern a bit. It's a strapless. Like it's a multi-way. Okay. Because <clears throat> with something like this, I like it strapless. But it doesn't look too bad. Like the, stra the, the straps. What's going on? I have to talk slow because my throat is swollen. So I'm editing the video right now, and I can't help but wonder if her sore throat has anything to do with her sexual activities. There has been cases of gonorrhea of the throat, and I hope that she doesn't have that, but it's a good thing that she is going to the doctor. I do recommend that she gets tested for everything. All right. These girls, I swear, it's like they have so much in common. Like, it's a little strange. Uh, it's like a nice purple plunge push-up. Plunge and push-up if you want to have sexy boobs again. Looks a bit big in the cup size, so it probably will be. Okay, <laughs> I got a 46D is what I usually get. I don't know if they shipped everything yet. What is this? This is... Oh, this is a 4X. Oh, these are shorts. That's why. Oh, really? They might be a bit big, though. I guess she's bottom heavy. For me, I'm like top heavy. Like, I feel like I buy a large shirt and medium pants. <clears throat> I need you some gotta more have booty. At least one pair of shorts. And the material isn't like cat furry magnet material. Hi, hammer guys. Oh, yeah. She has to worry about all that cat hair. It only took like a couple days for the store to come here every time. Yes. Oh, my tub. I wonder if they Every had to, to say goodbye. you know, I wonder why. I wonder what she has to pay for shipping. Like, I wonder if it comes from the United States or not. <laughs> Probably. Oh. oh, this is a 4X. She's really been getting um, a ton of lingerie, it appears. Who is this for? Isn't this nice? You know, she bought yeah, all this lingerie, I have to think, you know, and she got rid of her only fans does do you guys remember her only fans like that was only like a month and a half ago that was like her biggest scandal at the time and she's buying all this lingerie she showed the goods for free on live by accident because it's clingy clingy to your skin so it's almost like what's the point what was the point of it's deleting lingerie. it <laughs> yeah it's going what do you think is it cute yeah it was like 93 dollars. i think it was on sale or i had tour cash she didn't really have to put up that much content. I mean, people really don't. Just like a few pictures a month. And then her like foodie feeder, or I mean, her like foodie fans that like just really like the SSBBW stuff will stick around just to support her. I think that that's like, that's what she should have, you know, focused on. Not um just like general YouTube people. She should have focused on those men. And I would say that that would be perfectly okay for her to do. Just say, you know, you guys, this is for like people who like this kind of content. This is not going to be like my YouTube channel. She should have went that route. I had like 400 bucks worth of tour cash. And then That's if people crazy. were disappointed, just be like, well, it's not for you. <laughs> what do you think? Nice? I think it's going to be nice. <laughs> oh yeah i Can't would respect I that hustle but the crap One that she days. pulled was not well not right now but not it know. yeah you could have tried that on <laughs> oh, she could have put that stuff up on uh, up on there just the, like sandals like this i have a very short foot <laughs> it's just wide oh she has I like little baby me. feet they should i mean my Hootie, foot is short Hootie, 
the it's not the length I need, it's the width, you know? She could have done that kind of content on her only <laughs> So I just got a plain t-shirt. I do not find that appealing, like feet stuff. I don't find it appealing at all. Like I just don't even get it. I look like a Flintstone? Oh no, really? Oh my Which gosh. One? Bam People bam. I used to say I laugh like Betty Rubble. <laughs> okay, so this is a 4X because I want it to be Okay, it's that's an exercise cute. shirt, you know? I guess. I mean it's so plain. I can wear this with my like cute workout leggings and my new shoes. We're living and like a plain moment. Cool. I feel like this is the summer of like plain t-shirts. <laughs> bam, bam. Yeah, exactly. Remember Kazoo? That like guy that would just appear? What is his name? I don't know. <laughs> I didn't watch it. Vegetable soup. Campbell's vegetable soup. And every can has like oh, a yeah. lentil or two in it. Like, you ever notice that? I don't know if it's like no. a lentil. It's a little brown round thing. And I always used to like looking for it. And I used to call it the kazoo because of how rare it appeared. Maybe, I guess. Oh. <laughs> Um, I have an appointment tomorrow to talk to my doctor. My throat is not sore anymore. It's just swollen. Okay. Is she going to tell All the right. doctor about the things that she was doing? So is she still seeing the therapist? I like, I can't keep up because these girls, these girls, the girls, the girls, they see the therapist for like a day and then you never hear about them again. So I just assume that that's like over with. But it's going to be shitty all week. It's like not the weather's not, the weather's not going to be nice. I feel like I have a deep voice, which is totally fine. Oh, I got some accessories too. Hold on. We're not finished. Oh, sunglasses. I feel like ZZ Top. Hold on. I don't think that, I don't know like who doesn't want to hear this, but I don't think that if you're on um, like psych medications, like it's not really recommended to take THC. Never take edibles on an empty stomach. I'm back to not liking food again. Oh. Up so, and down, up still. and down. Don't do anything I do during this period of time. You can tell that, like, it looks like they just, like, kicked in. Like, we just kind of witnessed that. Because in the beginning of the video, I mean, she seemed fine, right? Not any more unusual than uh, regularly. It's nice to see her up. They're going to be too small for my face. Because oh, this yeah, was up early. <laughs> well, it was up kind of early. She was up at, like, 1. But she had to have been up early to shower and put on makeup. All right. Let's check out the glasses. Love them. <laughs> My hair. I just okay. need better hair. Are those like jewels or like flowers? <laughs> um, yeah. My sure. hair. I yeah. look like I look like meatloaf. And I would do anything. They fit. I like the the things at the end. They don't go with, well with this outfit though. Yeah, I guess not. Uh -uh. I like them. But I won't do that. Anyone know what he won't do for love? I don't know. I'm not like hard to please when it comes to women's items because like I just don't really know too much about it. So like if it looks okay, like I'm like, okay. <laughs> oh yeah. Looks good. It's like a lace, it's like a silky, it's a silky lacy robe. Oh, okay. Like, so that's like a kind of number that she could show up at the house, like show up to, you know, get the door, like hi. And then whoop, whoop, <laughs> peekaboo. <laughs> uh like nude and you need to get up to pee you can put this on it's sexy you know oh well she <laughs> she has a room where she has a bathroom like in the room so all these like really like sexy romantic scenarios in my head and they never turned out that way that means like, like there would need to be a man there with her for that to make sense <laughs> You get up to go pee and you come back with this and you're hoping he'll notice and meanwhile he's probably just like um take it off what? Don't you want to hug me in it first and feel how silky and sexy it is? Romance is dead. <laughs> Seriously. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, well, I'll wear it for myself. No, men don't even really care that much about clothes. Like, when you ask, like, straight men about, like, makeup, for example, they're just like, yeah, I don't care. You look fine without it. That's usually the answer. <laughs> COVID sex hour with Foodie Beauty. Okay, two more items. She's infuriating. <laughs> no, you do anything but give up on their love. She seems to be in relatively oh. positive spirits. I'll still forget. I'll still forget that. Oh yeah, this is gonna be too small. I don't know why I did this. Three X and this. Wow. That looks well, tiny. This will have to be like an under. Thank you. Thanks. Oh, these are four. But these are the these are the thongs. I don't know. We don't really need to see her unmentionables. To go with the lingerie? 
Oh yeah, that's gonna look it's gonna look nice. I was wearing another What's black lacy on? lingerie <clears throat> and we just like made love. I don't know what to call it. And then he went down to the See look, like, she's still infatuated with this man despite everything that went on and all the red flags that she had talked about herself as being red flags. She's still infatuated with this man. <sighs> something and then I followed him and he just looked at me for like a second and he was like you look really good though and I was just like oh my god like it was just so nice I don't know do you guys like it when a man like compliments your appearance I mean don't rely on that for like your whole like, I would tell her to just like you know find someone else who's better for her um you can't tell her what to do anyway but I just keep hearing about how horrible it is in Ontario right now like self-esteem or anything but okay this is a 4x too but it's still really nice when they do it and this is, oh, this is see-through. Okay, so that black tank top will come in handy. But I was thinking of this with the shorts. So I'll put the black tank Ew. top, this. <clears throat> it's almost like, what's the point? I mean, the whole, <laughs> whole thing is see-through. It's like a lacy tablecloth. And these earrings to go with it. Really cute. Spring, or I didn't mean it like that. Look. <laughs> oh, guys. You can tell she's starting to lose temptation grip on a little bit. Guilty pleasure. I don't like the circle that much because I don't know. Yeah, the circles. I watched the whole thing. So who might even say that? But uh, congratulations to the winner. If you guys have seen Circle Season 2, such a good winner. But um, Chantal was talking about in a previous live stream that she thinks they should do Temptation Island with all bigger women <laughs> and men that, I guess, enjoy bigger women. That would be an interesting concept for a show. Uh, come on, TLC. Game itself. I don't like the game itself. Aren't these nice when I like work eh. up the pinks? <laughs> you just Those, wear them. I'm not really a fan of. Yeah. With this purple top, it's going to be really colorful. I don't have anything really colorful. I have to be honest. I'll put like a nice gold and like pink makeup with like a purple lipstick. Everything was cute, but I don't really like this. Yeah. Might be too much, but why are you worried about me? I'm good. I'm okay. Everyone in the chat was, because I was watching this live, um, at least the tail end. She was really out of it. And a lot of the comments were people saying, like, get it together, girl. Like, what are you doing? It's only 2 p.m. You're already so greened out. I'm okay. So, yeah. So, I don't know what to do with that new lingerie, though. That sucks. <clears throat> I guess I'll save it for when I can use it. Because I'm fried. I'm not fried. I already showed everything I got in the Torrid Hall, so. Hi, Jax. No, I'm not in any pain, but my throat is swollen. These are not going to fit me, are they? They're going to be too big? These are ugly. <laughs> Let's see. <laughs> Yellow shoes. Yeah, they're kind of... <laughs> Those are kind of ugly. Maybe like a blue, but like less tie-dye, like more white. All right, you guys, that's going to be it for today's video. That was the rest of the Torrid haul for the rest of the video. You know, she's really just like not there. It's a very sad state of affairs. I wouldn't uh, be surprised if this video was deleted from her channel just because of the state that she's in, the absolute state of it all. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. I will, of course, catch you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.